But sugar cube, I'm going to put this onto the table. And we're going to make it sugar. Oh, oh no. <coughs> it's fine. It's fine. Yeah. All right. So, come up with a title. Come up with a title for each thing you do. Yep. And then, am I breaking bonds? <laughs> yes or no? Freshly ground. And I'm going to dissolve it in water. So would this be a separate one? This is a separate one, yes. So this is number two, if you want. Cooper, pentahydrate, whatever. I'm going to smash it with a hammer. Except it's not a hammer, it's this thing. Which is like a hammer. Oh, MC Martin. hammer. <laughs> I'm going to put the smashed, freshly ground copper tube pentahydrate into sugar water. And it's now in molten salt. So, so you see that jiggling around? It's just salt, and I didn't melt it and make it into water or anything weird. That's a liquid salt. breaking any bonds, what I'm going to do is I'm going to pour a tiny amount on the table, and that's it. Breaking bonds. Technically, or...? What time, yes or no? Sorry, did you want to say that again? Slow motion? That's why we video tape it. We'll go to the film. Starting it now, <laughs> am I breaking <laughs> bonds? Oh my god. Got that? Nice. And the answer is yes or no. <laughs> Question is when I hit the tuning fork, am I breaking bonds? Inside the tube, am I breaking bonds? Let me see if I can get it to be a little louder. So for candle one, however you want to name that, but name it a one. I actually am burning whatever wax is traveling up that way. Question is, am I breaking bonds? Answer is yes or no. Is the wax exclusively that's dripping from the one candle to the other? Not the burning, but the dripping. Am I breaking bonds, yes or no? People have never seen a wave like that, right? So this is a wave, but this is also a wave. 